thank you so much for being our first guest of our new TV show called How's Your Waffle? So happy to have you. Great to be here. So, Ron, the great thing about this show is that you're here. I'm going to ask you questions. You get to eat a Best Western Waffle. Delicious. You have all of these toppings to choose from. But I do ask that you don't talk with your mouth full. Like, that was a big bite. But nobody wants to see that. So, okay. that's the only rule. Thought we were here to eat waffles. We are, but just let's keep some decorum. Uh, all right. So, Ron, do you want some whipped cream? Love some whipped cream. I mean, who doesn't love whipped cream? Everybody on loves whipped cream. I know. You just tell me when. Okay, when. So, Ron, you okay, are when. the. Oh, oh, done. Okay. Yeah. Gosh. Thank you. Must, you. you Thank like you. Whipped cream. It's awesome. How's that whipped cream? There's That's a there's lot. there's an abundance of it. Yeah, it's, you should have told me not to. Yeah, I did several on. times. Okay. So in the short time I've been here. We have announced, we've launched so many new brands. What is the relevance? Why are we trying to do that? What's, why is it good for Best Western? Well, our, our customers are changing. Mm -hmm. If you think about the demographics of, you know, from baby boomers to millennials to beyond, they all have different expectations in travel. They all have different purposes of travel. And, and our goal is to be able to fill that void in every segment of the lodging industry whether it's luxury with world hotels, mm -hmm. clear down to sure stay in the economy segment. Mm -hmm. There are customers for each one of those segments. And mm -hmm. it's not about dividing up the customers we have, it's about attracting more. So it's not cutting up the waffle, it's making a bigger waffle. Oh, I see what you did there. You see there? Yeah. So I like that. we're eating big waffles today. <laughs> we are eating <laughs> big waffles. I feel like I've had a lot of this waffle. Yeah. Yeah, and you've had a lot of whipped cream. Yes, well, that's all I had to eat was whipped cream. Mm -hmm. Thank you. You should have told me when to uh, stop. Several times. Yeah. Um, so speaking of Sherstay, that brand has really exploded, the growth. It's been tremendous, mm -hmm. and I think it's exceeded all expectations, but not just in North America. Internationally, we're having phenomenal success, and that's uh, you know a market that we were counting on, but probably didn't expect that the, the opportunities would be as, as vast as they are. So, uh, you know, we'll it come close to 300 hotels in 2020 in the Sure Stay brand in less than three years. And I keep, I know that the TripAdvisor ratings are pretty phenomenal for Sure Stay. So both the TripAdvisor ratings are high, mm -hmm. but as is the ADR index and the rates that mm -hmm. those hotels are able to demand mm -hmm. uh, is, is very exciting and, and it's why it, developers are attracted to the brand. Mm -hmm. And guests, I mean obviously guests really love the brand if they're ranking their stays with such high reviews. Th they are, mm -hmm. and, and again, uh, exceeding expectations there. There was never an industry leader in the economy segment mm -hmm. and that was the position we wanted Sure Stay to command and it has. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. You have some waffle, I think a little bit of whipped cream in your beard. You can leave it, but. Shocker. Yeah. yeah. There's a lot of whipped cream on yeah. that. Yeah, but I think you have some in your mustache. That just wasn't nice. Um, okay, we're just gonna move on from that. So, serious question about convention. You made a lot of really big announcements. Um, and you sang live on stage, Ron, which was pretty amazing. I know everybody loved it. So not everybody. You, really? Yeah. Well, I do. Wanna, I didn't. You didn't. I didn't. <laughs> Have, do you sing often? Have you been? No. No. Okay. Not even karaoke. Wow. Okay. Well, I thought yeah. you did a good job. Well, thank you. You're welcome. So you made a lot of announcements. I was hoping you could kind of go into those, and I was thinking maybe you could sing your responses today. No. Um, but it was a great convention. Members loved it. Feedback was very positive. Educational sessions were, I think, the best we've ever had. Uh, and, and certainly, some key initiatives from our perspective uh, with the property revenue management program and how we we're able to discount that to get more hotels to use it. We know that 2020 is going to be challenging, so giving them additional resources is, is important at the lowest fee possible. Uh, we announced that we are going to include eight nines and tens in medallia ratings, which is again something we've heard from members for a number of years and 
uh, we're able to uh, build it into our system for measurements going forward. So I think those are very positive. Mm -hmm. We have a very strong development pipeline as we look to, head, to, mm -hmm. to the years ahead. Mm -hmm. um, and you know, I kind of closed on the whole discussion around sustainability because for once in our career, hotels can adopt some sustainability practices mm -hmm. that actually will save them money. Mm -hmm. We talked about amenity dispensers, uh, how Best Western Rewards can save money in housekeeping services, mm -hmm. uh, even our breakfast program. You know, we now have awesome. biodegradable products mm -hmm. in all aspects of breakfast, from the utensils to the plates, straws, Mm, you know, that's so important. It, it is. I mean, paper straws, they yeah, save the I only environment. Use paper. Yeah, that's really important. Mm -hmm. So, I agree with you. There's, there's a, a, yeah. an opportunity there for hotels to really take advantage of some of the key uh, sustainability efforts today. Have you ever thought about growing out your hair? I, I don't know. Really? Well, I just think it would look nice, just a little bit more on top. I mean, the beard is good. But I think this is the area that needs just a little bit more, I don't know, hair, maybe? You have a long eyebrow, like right yeah. out of place. Big eyebrows are really in. But, but it's out of place. I, I like it that way. Okay. Right. Yeah. It's gray, too. Yeah. Your beard is like all gray. <laughs> okay. Um, so, what brought you to Best Western? I mean, you've been here for. 13 a long time. years. 13 years. 13 years. years. Lucky wow. 13. Wow. David's been here for 15. You've been here for 13. He's been here longer than that. You better oh, get that straight. CEO. You're yeah. right. 15 as CEO, 18 with Best Western. There you go. Yeah. Let's just and keep that between us that I didn't know that. Yeah. Mum's the word. Thank you. So it, it really was his vision that brought me to Best Western. I had background with Marriott, with Hilton, and uh, as we refer to Best Western over the years, it was a sleeping giant. But David saw what the potential was, and that was the excitement that I needed to join Best Western and look where we are today from one brand to 16, if you include every, every brand that we have today. And you previously worked at Marriott, is that correct? I, I worked for Marriott initially, okay. uh, yes. So any idea what Bonvoy means? Nobody knows. Nobody knows, so it's not just it's just not just me. It, it's Nobody almost like knows. someone forgot the age at the end. Yes, as in bon voyage. voyage. Yes. Yeah, That's I got it. Yeah. You're sharp. Yeah, I am sharp. Yeah. That's why I had up communications here wrong. Right. So speaking of um, really powerful, hard-hitting questions, what's your favorite breed of cat? I'm sure. Lion. Lion? I'm a Leo. You're a Leo. Yeah. There's two types Can of people in the world, Leos and those more? who wish they were. Oh. Yeah. Yeah. It's Lions okay. have a lot of hair. Yeah. They have a mane. They do. <laughs> Are you gonna have Can I help you with some uh, toppings? It looks sure. very dry. Yeah, it was actually a little bit dry. Yeah, I yeah. thought you should. Yeah. Then maybe, maybe, maybe some chocolate Maybe chips. some chocolate, yeah, some yeah. little bit of chocolate. That's, that was, yeah. that's a good amount. Yeah, maybe some whipped cream. Maybe some whipped cream. You, mm -hmm. you would like some whipped mm -hmm. cream. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Oh, that's, that's good. Is that yeah, good? just Is stop that good right there, Ron. Really? Really, Ron? <laughs> How's your waffles? <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah, we need the waffles. And I was thinking maybe you would want to sing your responses. Sorry, I just For moved. For purposes of... Do we need a new waffle? For Ron. Oh, when? Woo! When? That's exciting. <laughs> you maybe shouldn't have dinner. Hmm. That's a lot of calories, you know? What are we trying to do? <laughs> those berries are delicious. <laughs> Should have put those on my waffle. Strawberries. Oh. Thank you. You're welcome. <laughs> He's exhausting. <laughs>